before I proceed, I would like to show you the symbols which I used yesterday. All of them are available on the Android phone. So you can type any word in Konkani, you can type on an Android phone using the symbol. For example, you want to type this word, aso. How to type? First of all, on an Android phone, you have to download Samsung keyboard. You may have a Google keyboard. Google keyboard gives most of the symbols except one, that the sound, that C over it, there is a circumflex, not circumflex, inverted V, that you will not get. But in Samsung keyboard, all the symbols are available. Now, let us try. Aso, how to type this word aso? Okay. Now, I will go on letter O. I press it. And I can see here a. Uh. So, a uh comes. Then you type yes. Then you type O. Oh. Aso. A uh comes. You want this capital. This O uh to be capital. Then you press. Go same. This place. Now you got the first in capital. That's one. Then that closed vowel that is this a how to write pair p i press on e go here pair i want the closed one chore this word chore how to type c H, go once again O, hold it, and you will see here. So now you want to type that word going, going here. Last that is here. This word going, how to type this? G. Go on O, you find that with the till, going, going. Now you want to type word which I so far it has not come here, but it will come today. Now in Konkani there is a word called Chudu. Chudu means girl. How to type that? Hold it on C. You come here. Type. Yeah. Only this on C, this inverted word, on C there is a, a small v. This symbol is not available on the Google keyboard. Rest all symbols are available on the Google keyboard. Why Google keyboard? is not providing this symbol i have no idea but samsung keyboard provides all the symbols which are required for konkani and with this symbol as i said yesterday you can write konkani 100% correct scientific trust me i say this with authority for example a person wants to have should go undergo an open heart surgery what that person will do? He or she will find out who is the best surgeon, heart surgeon. And after finding out, he or she approaches the surgeon and uh, they talk to the surgeon, they show all the reports and everything, and the date is fixed for an operation. Will that patient will ask the doctor, doctor, how you are going to perform the operation, what tools are you going to use, what medicine are you going to use. 
will he or she ask no you trust the surgeon because the person trusted the surgeon he or she surrenders same way in a language you must trust me because i will not try to cheat you in any way no i know my subject with experience every day i'm learning even last night after the session based on the questions and the questions were not asked i reflected i sat down and whatever notes i had prepared to present today i revised it and i'm going to present so every day as a surgeon learns new things i'm also learning new words new sentences new expressions new way of teach okay this does not mean you should not question me no 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 i'm not saying that surely all the doubts and all you should ask but if you wonder why this is standard pronunciation why not that i can answer that but in this course if we entertain such questions then we will not proceed further therefore now i will allow 5 minutes only for your doubts and clarifications what i taught you yesterday yesterday we learned konkani vowels eight oral vowels and we learn eight nasal vowels this much we learned yesterday so do you have any doubt any word which you cannot pronounce which i given example meaning you you don't need me it is there but pronunciation or something related if you have questions you are free to ask uh, tanushri uh, bhushan has a question father yes you can unmute yourself and ask the question yes can you hear me yes uh yes sir i wanted to ask about the word sata and satam um truth and uh, truth in plural yes so in that you had uh, yes when you when you say am uh, then it it's a ah. so ah, correct when does the m uh, become strong like where you say it fully and when do you say it just as a with the nasal vowel i will come to that when, when we learn the consonant when to say m when that m become m and when it is nasalizes i will tell nasalization you know okay okay word final yes, yes. m nasalizes but when to say m m is a consonant then we are going to learn right. it today and you will get okay. the answer thank you katrin mundal can we have your question yes yes father uh, this uh, there is a word uh, hen kombi what i hear is uh, m sound but it is written n so how we pronounce kombi what is no that? it is not kombi it is kombi kombi ko 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 and b kombi okay so if you separate it is like ko and b correct you are okay, right okay. See, there are two syllables here yeah 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 one this is one and this is second one okay father ko ko b okay kombi okay. and this okay. is ko 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 yes and bo oh. okay 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 because when i hear it sounds like ko m is like pronounced like kom like no it is okay. not combo it okay. is not combo it is okay. not kombi okay thank let you let me remind you there are such people in north goa especially bordering maharashtra i mean they are in goa there okay. are people from goa they are especially at padne side they say kombi and combo they don't okay. say kombi and combo okay ah thank you to the influence of uh, <clears throat> no i i am i'm nowhere in goa because i'm totally new to this language so i just yeah. thank you uh, father they have uh, confusion with uh, the pronunciation of bye so because most of them bye bye well well bye yeah 
so they are saying it like bani bani means well this is the word they are trying to ask that word came yesterday uh ah where it uh, here no where it came here yesterday so uh, no the... it came in the exercise yeah yeah correct. it came in the exercise let me uh minimize this i will minimize and i go for uh here yes yesterday we had this one here by by this is by the b a n is ba ba and here by it cannot be bani to become bani it should be i b a n i becomes bani in my system okay let me repeat the y letter as one pronunciation here in konkani in this system it cannot become bani to become bani you have to write b a n i bani and when you write this way it is bai okay shall we proceed for consonants now yes i sir. think uh, nobody yeah. else has any yeah. any more doubt yeah, yeah we can we proceed for the now consonants. that vowels we have not finished vowels we have finished but exercises we have not finished there's we one more question to consonants and when we complete the consonants we will go back to vowel exercises okay okay yeah. so there's somebody else also wants to ask one more question yes Anjali, yes yeah father if uh, like in the first uh, slide and in the consonants you have given the devra nagri also in the pronunciation yeah if you can put that in the nasal sounds also because it will help your learners so in the beginning it's a little difficult uh, no so. see for me uh, the difficulty here i don't know devanagari typing i gave up devanagari typing long back i knew little bit and then it becomes here all uh, it is a different font altogether okay. you have to get okay. see you have to learn through roman only devanagari okay. if i write the system they write one thing pronounce totally different so okay. you may think the impression that devanagari is a perfect script for konkani no 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 i am ready to have at any platform one to one face to face to disprove no no i'm not I'm, i'm not saying that but both together help some of us who know both that's, no that's all. you, you take okay. little it's trouble okay. yeah, yeah, yeah little trouble here yeah. you yeah. will learn within no time for instance you take yeah. here you take this word let us take consonants you see here we have 38 consonants in konkani 16 vowels letter example meaning example meaning and pronunciation as it is in english you take the first letter k letter k has the pronunciation k k a become ka you know this pronunciation of this is this symbol is a so when you add to k this become ka and double d means d d this symbol we will learn here below down for the time being it is card it cannot be anything else then card it cannot be card it cannot be cad it cannot be cord no in konkani one and only one pronunciation for one symbol card means remove another example kando ka this n nasalizes this vowel ka ka kando kando onion and this k to be pronounced as if in english king how do we pronounce this letter in english same one is this k the next one is k aspirated sound we don't have a symbol therefore we use kh in devanagari they have an independent symbol k this is unaspirated 
this is aspirated you need a, a the breath you need a lot of breath to come out this is less but without much effort you can say card and this is card this is not card this is card means beard those who are from salset south goa catholics i'm referring they will have difficulty in this because they will say card no card and this is card and here khando khando branch how to pronounce this one english doesn't have any word but there is a surname in india khan khan it is not khan it is khan surname so this pronunciation is equal to this one let me repeat once again card card kando kando next consonant g gut we know this one is g and this double t mean t gut means group gut gut this one gadi g a ga double d i d gadi weak vehicle how do you pronounce this letter in the word girl same pronunciation for this next one the aspirate sound of g is g gut this is gut and this is gut strong this is gadi and this is ghadi sorcerer the witch doctor ghadi how to pronounce that one as if it is in ghana g h a n a ghana some similar to that i don't say exactly because from english we don't have any examples to give to you because english doesn't have such a strong aspiration only in indian languages we have this aspiration k kh g gh and now comes c c h e c this is the most difficult sound in konkani for non konkani speakers how to pronounce this one third 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 more and this one chalo 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 sun there is no such sound doesn't exist in english it doesn't exist in latin french portuguese dutch you mention western europe european languages that sound doesn't exist in india sanskrit no hindi no bengali no gujarati no konkani and marathi they have this sound this is called technical language is called affricate sound found in konkani and marathi only sir you know others and most of you also will say chird it is not chird it is third third i mean online i cannot teach you it is Uh, offline then even to teach this sound even after a month i have seen some learners still cannot get it they say chird i say third and they say chird to pronounce this one let me give you a clue in your mouth your tongue should be flat touching your teeth it should be flat like this your suppose your teeth are like this the tongue should touch like this straight my hand is not still straight it is still bent should be and then you say sir sir third chalo next one ch i put a symbol here this is simple cheat cheat 
attention chado 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 sun cherry this in english we have church chart this practically most of the languages we have indian and the western languages have this sound ch but this ch no no so which you will find difficult those who do not know konkani they will find really difficult to learn this sound if you know kannada tamil tulu any other language still you cannot pronounce it but those who know marathi yes they will know they have no difficulty to pronounce this word third and chalo this is cheat and chado the next one is the aspirate sound of this we don't have aspirate sound of this one no but aspirate sound of this ch is ch ch chap chap means print print and chappi printer there is no english equivalent that sound to give you therefore i left blank this is chap and chappi very few words we have with this maybe 4 to 5 not more than that with this the next one is z z zalm 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 but zal zal net how do you pronounce this one zu zu that pronunciation but many <coughs> indian uh, speakers they cannot pronounce even this word is you saying zu they say ju ju no zu is you saying zalm they say jalm is you saying zal they say jal no zalm see uh, if you know hindi below this z there is a dot in hindi zameen kagaz this the that sound z this sound for us come into konkani from persian language zalm zalm zal zal next one the aspirate sound of z is z zard zard plant and zhar zhar means stream water stream whatever uh, this is simpler all languages have this is j j we write j to write z we write z and to write j we write j jivit jivit look at the spelling j i v i t jivit life jev jev dine like english judge this pronunciation of this letter is same as this then the aspirate sound of this j is j chilkut chilkut bush a thorny bush is called chilkut and another example jeent jeent swoon you got a news of a person a very dear to you died of accident and you get a such a shock that is called jeent jilkut jeent next one double t double t is t t what what way dart dart thick not exactly but 
very close to how do we say cat that t stronger than this t is this t they are not exact then comes the aspirate sound of this t is t t tharao tharao resolution which you take in a meeting tharao another example kathor kathor cruel now there is a surname in uh, india this is thakur not thakur it is thakur those who know hindi they will pronounce this correctly thakur or those who know marathi also will think though is written th it is not thakur it is thakur a surname then comes d double d means d mad mad m a ma double d d mad coconut tree card card remove once again similar i not exactly how do you say dog this d and this d have some similarity not exact this is stronger this is lighter dog and this is d the aspirate sound of this is d d dongi dongi hypocrite and dong dong hypocrisy there is no english equivalent here to give you and these <clears throat> very few words are there maybe four four words are there with this consonant double d d h d this is d and this is d and comes now n double n n chan chan kaudan oh here i made a mistake man man wax and there is no english equivalent for this sound rna sound there is no equivalent these are all typical indian languages sound from here t th d d n in uh, linguistics they are called retroflex sounds is a technical term don't worry about it next comes t look at now carefully this is single t t and this is double t t t tan tan see here this n is pronounced at the end because there is nothing else here therefore it cannot be tan word final n is pronounced tan thirst and this is sat truth now this t is something like tintu portuguese tintu that t because english strictly speaking doesn't have this sound t portuguese has the next one is T H T. Look at this one. T T H is T, and this is T H is T. Thick, thick, gem. Third, third, third. Place. How do you pronounce English? This one thin, and this is. similar not exactly identical but they are very close this th and this th then comes d let me remind you here double d d 
and here single d the dud dud you cannot say dud this one no d u do and this one the dud dud milk these these yesterday i told you in monosyllable word if there is one vowel that it is slightly prolonged it is not this it is these these day something something like this english day day or portuguese would be much better dia in Portu portuguese dia means day then comes the aspirate sound of the is the dhar 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 hold dharan 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 dam and how to pronounce this dh there's a proper noun in india dharmendra dharmendra they are identical this dh and this dh are identical in pronunciation dharmendra then comes single n here above you saw double n that is na and this single n means na na nak nak nose natu na tu natu grandson how do you pronounce this letter in english same one it is nine n no. and n no. identical here down below i given another example sanwar i put an apostrophe here even in the traditional system they put an apostrophe why if you don't put an apostrophe it becomes sanwar what is our rule in initial position or medial position to nasalize the vowel we use n but here we should say n sun war sun war saturday therefore there is apostrophe is very essential without that apostrophe it becomes sanwar next example don par don par if you remove this apostrophe it become don par don par and there is no such word in konkani don par this is don par noon when n sound has to be pronounced in the medial position we put apostrophe for n there is an aspirate sound in konkani devanagari also doesn't have a symbol and roman also doesn't have a symbol we write nh nan 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 bath as a noun bath nani 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 bathroom in the in the sense in in the way you have bath that place is bathroom for us in konkani nani means bathroom because in english there are different washroom and different names are there but here this nani refers to where you go and bathe yourself nothing else is done there that is called nani then comes pa pan pan leaf pal pal lizard 
like english palm this per and this per are identical there is no aspirate sound in konkani for per we have all together another different consonant for for fool this is exactly like english f fool flower and furl furl fruit this sound those who know marathi they cannot pronounce they say pool pool it is not pool it is fool most of the indian languages do not have this sound hindi has this sound like saaf saaf this sound for us has come from persian and from portuguese sources mainly first it came from persian for like fox fox a marathi speaker or hindi speaker or kannada malayalam tamil they say fox the fox came they will say they can't say fox for then comes b b baldi bal di baldi bucket bauli bau li bauli dog like english bird this b and this b are identical then aspirate sound of this b is b bhas bhas language and bhat bhat property something like english a bore this b but this is softer but this is stronger b next come m m moose moose fly fly amas amas new moon what i written here new moon correct like monkey how do you say m in monkey same m it is here now somebody asked me a question that sat and sata when that m sound here look at here now this example kam there is an apostrophe if you don't put apostrophe as per our uh father father your mic is on mute can you just unmute yourself go back to zoom and uh, unmute yourself in popular konkani writing this is not written only in the church konkani it is written kam without that apostrophe it become ka it is not ka it is kam in the sense work same way gham without apostrophe it become gha so apostrophe makes it gham sweat so i have answered the question that lady who asked uh, Uh, when to say m when you put apostrophe after m it become m m and here remember this also sanwar 
when you want that na to be pronounced as na you put apostrophe without apostrophe it nasalizes the previous vowel so these are conventions then comes there is an aspirate sound of ma ma maka maka to me and mataro mataro old man and there is no english equivalent for that now year year guy now don't say gay that is english guy cow bye sister how do you say yes that year is this one r rat don't say rat rat is in english we are reading konkani so rat r a r a t means the rat night ras ras keep race this r and this r are identical in pronunciation then comes l l kal kal yesterday yesterday limbo this n nasalizes this vowel limbo lemon how do you pronounce this l l l large same one is here identical there is an aspirate sound of l l l lan lan l h a n lan small and lar lar wave in english this consonant is not there no pronunciation for this but portuguese something there is laneza laneza means humility in that sense it is there now pay careful attention to this v letter but its pronunciation is w for us in english though we say v you have to bite your lower lip for us it is like w the pronunciation of this is like here w w w but since for centuries we have used now v i didn't dare to change to w otherwise i should have changed w and not v because this pronunciation we don't have in english and european languages this is v and for us this is w w what what candle was was smell like w the pronunciation of w for us w same thing is for us here then we use v h w wall wall stream and warn warn slipper there is no equivalent w h pronunciation w here that i have not given and then comes we write x but its pronunciation is sh sh traditionally not in konkani other language they they write sh that is correct x and sh is the same pronunciation sh chic <coughs> chic study and sheer sheer vein fish you say fish this sh this sh is equal to this x 
in Konkani we, we did not write SH. Why? By writing one letter is sufficient for us. It saves space for us. For this you need space, extra space, SH. Therefore we write X. Traditionally in Goa it is written X. But pronunciation is SH. Cheek, cheer. Next is Sir. Sir. Saat, Saat, seven. And Saat, Saat, seventy. As if in English, Sir, that Sir and this Sir are identical. Then comes Her, Hat. Hat. In English it is hat, but we are reading company. So it is hat. Hand. And Hans. Hans. This N nasalizes the previous vowel. So Hans. Laugh. Like English. Her. Habit. This H and this H are identical. Look at this. Double L and here it is single L. This is L and this is R. Dolo. Dolo. I and Golo. Golo. Throat. There is no English equivalent. And people, the Catholics in Goa, I don't say all, but the vast majority cannot pronounce this R. They cannot pronounce, they, they say dolo, dolo. They make single L. No, dolo and golo. This has to be learnt. L sound. This is also a retroflex sound. So L and L. These are the consonant 38. 38 consonants. Let me go here. I taught you right now. So here itself. Brief. Another point. Do you have any doubts about what I taught you just now? Uh, set, set is 60. Second? Set is 60. Set. Set. Sat. Sat is 60. Yes. I will come to and sir. Sotor, sotor is 70. Yeah, yeah. Here, yes, what happened? Uh, Sat is 60 and Sotor is 70. Sat is 7. Oh, sorry, I made a mistake here. Sorry, thank you for correcting me. It is not 70, it is 60. Sotor 70, yeah. Yes, you are right. Thank you for. Thank you. Yes. Any other doubts? Yeah. If you don't have doubts, now we shall go to cons clusters of consonants. Uh, Father, I, I just had one one doubt. Yes. Uh, uh, you know, when we when we go and say Maka, we, we normally say Maka, but uh, when you pronounced it, you said Ma, Maka. Yes, it is there. You checked other um, uh, what you call the company in Kannada script or Devanagari script okay. it is there because that usually in spoken one you must remember Goa Konkani is the language of the subaltern in Indian term of the Dalits Konkani is the language of the downtrodden simple people it is not the language of the elite Portuguese was the language of elite and now it has been replaced by English. You Konkani speak anyway, doesn't matter. That is the attitude. And what I'm trying to bring, no, the language Konkani has the same status like Portuguese or German or any other one. Why can't we have that? Correct. Therefore, we must learn our language. I'm still learning my language. So humans uh, tendencies to go for ease of pronunciation. Sim simplification. So instead of saying maka, we say maka. Okay. Instead of saying uh, 
double l um, here we say single l no no this one they say dolo dolo or dowo no dolo dolo nothing is impossible to learn nothing Correct. i Correct. don't make a distinction between uh, language uh, of gender or color or uh, religion any person of any religion any color any gender any status should pronounce correctly and with these uh, uh, symbols surely of course off, uh, this online is difficult but offline one can learn this Dollar. yeah thank you father On, yes father uh, yes you gave us the spelling of guy for cow as g a y yes uh in previously we used to write g a i father so yes now... i know i know dear i know i know but how will write guy oh uh, huh? tell me no now. but can we not write i now father when we are spelling because now now, I get confused. No. now at the end i propose every way while writing now guy oh they're writing g a y o they accepted guy oh yes. huh? but when you read guy why no 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 that see this word is said no we are so language is become very become very orthodox writing system especially so become orthodox huh? we don't want to change but no, no i'm not saying that father what yeah. i'm saying is even for toy r we say no t o y a r yes guy, correct so both oh, yeah. are correct now t o i a r is also correct there come three vowels uh, uh, a learner will not know how to pronounce that three vowels oh, but in okay. this system you see very clearly g a ga any doubt g a ga okay no why no means here yes 2 plus 1 3 my system is just like mathematical i am a mathematics student before joining the society bsc so just like mathematics g a ga y means here 2 plus 1 3 guy like that take any word here any word you did not now for instance this such a big word looks m h a ma t a ta r o ro ma ta ro see just yes, like yes. children how children read this is the way syllable by syllable this is how you can read and you don't need me once you learn this you don't need me but people don't write this way what can i do i cannot change the whole world i hope one day they will accept many things they have accepted slowly they will accept because the future is now in the younger generation if the younger generation accepts everything could be changed everything now we have clusters of consonants when you join the consonants how to write now for example this we know t t and there is an apostrophe and t that mean double t cut t see here cut t if you don't put this apostrophe you don't know what is this four t means so just to simplify we have put an apostrophe cut t cut t the coconut shell this is d and d gud do gud do dafa the slow learner this is t cut t gud do double n kann kann a local sweet dish is prepared in goa and that is called kann kan this is double t pat to pat to address if you remove this apostrophe it become pato pato means belt or something it become so apostrophe here is absolutely necessary here even if you don't put apostrophe the pronunciation doesn't change but here you remove this apostrophe it become pato no it is pat to pat to address 
Similarly here, you remove this, it become the. You see the the jid jid perseverance apostrophe is essential. You remove this ap uh, apostrophe, it become jid jid. They become pato and they become jid. Apostrophe is very essential. Pato jid. Here also, apostrophe is essential. Otherwise, it becomes no. How to say? Pan nas. Pan nas. 50. You remove this, it becomes panas. Panas. It is not panas. It is pan nas. 50. Then, L apostrophe L. L, L. Mel, lo. Mel, lo. Dead. You remove this, it becomes mellow. There is no such word in Konkani. Mellow. So, mel, lo. Dead. Dead person. Then, lo, lo. Mel, lo. Mel, lo. Got. So these are the few consonant clusters, very essential. There are so many consonant clusters, but they are not difficult. But these are the difficult ones I have given. So up to now, yesterday we learnt 16 vowels and today we learnt 38 consonants. At least the information has been given to you. You may not be able to pronounce all those consonants. But let me now read only here. This column I am going to read for you. K. K. G. G. Z. Ch. Ch. Z. Z. J, J, T, T, D, D, N, T, T, D, D, N, N. This is N. And this is N. P. And this is F. This is not PH. No, we don't have PH sound in Konkani. P. F. B. B. M. M. Y. R. L. L. This is L and this is L. W. 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 Sh. S. H. And L. Actually, the consonant by itself cannot be pronounced. When I say S, I put a vowel here, a. Uh, remember, consonant themselves are not audible. They need a vowel, either a uh, or a uh, or e or u or a, a, o, o. Those eight vowels, oral vowels or eight nasal vowels are required to pronounce the consonant. But themselves, they cannot be pronounced. So, now, you know the symbols, you know the vowels and consonants. Now, if you, you have to learn this, if you, if you learn this correctly, you can read any word now in Konkani, any word. You may not know the meaning, but you can read. You can read. Shall we try? We'll try before we proceed. I'll minimize. Okay. Now I shall write here something. 
and I want one person, the Savya will decide who is the person, whoever, to read this for me, this word. Very small, I think I'll make it bigger. Yeah. I want a volunteer to read this. Anybody Ask. who wants to read it can uh, raise their hand. Ask. Once Ask. again. Ask. Ask. Correct. Correct. Somebody else. Somebody else. Not the same person. Can't. 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 Beg pardon? Can't. Can't. No, this one. Can't. Not this, cut. this one. Cut. No, you are saying cut. 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 Card. Card. Correct. Please allow others also to answer. Yes, others, others. Neil Lobo. Sheep. Sheep. Correct. Sheet. Sheet. Pard. 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 Pal. This is Pal and this is Pal. 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 Father, yes. when we say that Carl, it is K-A-L-L for season. Carl, yes, you are right. Season. And Carl means yesterday. Solo. Solo. This one? Solo. No. Solo. 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 One, one person, one person. Solo. Solo, correct. It cannot be anything else. Solo. Solo. Now, let me remind you here in this system you have a no in traditional how it is written let me show you i will put in a press this one presses in traditional system this is written this way you don't know is it cholo is it cholo it is cholo or it is chola. You don't know. Everything is oh. very difficult. And this system, no. This is a uh, and this is o. Oh. So cholo. Absolutely no doubt at all how to pronounce. This one you have a doubt. Let me give another example. How to pronounce this one? Chedu. Chedu. Correct. Chedu. 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 But no, I have to write here this way. Otherwise, it becomes Che. Chedu. This is Chedu. 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 When I write this way, it becomes Che. Che. Chedu. Do. Chedu. 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 So, this way, any word written, you will be able to pronounce unknown word. You may not know the meaning. But you can read. Let me write the last one word. Pustak. Pustak. Correct. Pook. Poo. Pustak. Pustak. This way. Meaning Absolutely book. no doubt. We will practice now. In a vowel exercise, we will have plenty of examples. We will practice there. And then you will see how this writing system helps you to read correctly, pronounce correctly. 
to learn a standard konkani which people will say then they will tell in their common language you speak a pure language they will say there is no pure language but people say shuddh bas they say in konkani huh? now okay that is all right we will go for exercises now yeah this one yesterday we did that but still let us uh, revise this oral vowels versus nasal vowels though yesterday we did this but what i have done today i have uh, given the its gender this we have done yesterday dar means a rate what is the gender of this noun masculine m means masculine i had said yesterday konkani has got three gender system masculine feminine and neuter feminine i write f and neuter nt is written neuter so dar to dar we say you cannot say ti dar or you cannot say ten dar you must say to dar because it's masculine to dar to dant because masculine to dant this is oral vowel and this is nasal vowel why nasal vowel n is written and n is nasalizing the previous vowel another one khat it is a neuter gender te khat stain and khant ti khant to remember the gender always you use the word to ti te if it is masculine you must say to to dar feminine you must say ti khant and neuter you must say te khant then you will remember that because remembering gender is a most difficult in konkani there is no rule very few rules are there you have to learn by heart by memory and the gender is very important otherwise you will make mistakes in konkani gender is very very important and i cannot help you there because this is everything memory work so but the help is this don't say simply there is masculine say to the moment you hear to you know it is masculine moment you hear ti you know it is feminine and when you hear te you know it is neuter take here ti nat granddaughter nat they are not there it is a phrase nat ti bai ti bai sister and T by, well, T by. Para, O oh child, and para. This is neuter plural, because singular of this is par, te par. Plural is T para. We will come to this because I have not taught you noun systematically. When I teach you, there it will come. This is neuter plural, par para it is, neuter plural. then chic tv tv means transitive verb now what is a transitive verb we shall see don't worry if you don't know transitive verb study this is chic intransitive verb now what is intransitive verb if you don't know don't worry i'll teach you sneeze then t t is feminine and it's a pronoun t and this is t neuter plural and pronoun its singular is t t e m t we are going to learn it maybe tomorrow oot intransitive verb rise oont camel oot versus oont our focus in this exercise in this paradigm is oral vowel versus nasal vowel all these other things i given an extra information so that you can learn its gender now itself then pd feminine plural ilsa fishes 
and this is pendi feminine plural bunches of fruit methi ti methi and ti mendi you ti pat wooden box te pant neuter gender therefore it's te pant trousers te masculine plural pronoun te they here i did not give this one because i have given already there masculine plural so i can delete this one here then te this is neuter pronoun neuter singularities te versus te it fold t fold piece or a boil let me remove boil because if you have boil it is it, it is got a different gender so let me give only one t fold to fold t fold to fold grave T kobi, T kombi, T cord, because it's a new term. T cord, ani T cond, T god, to gondo, to gondo, ani T goin the gender of go is neuter ten going you cannot say to going or t going no ten going so this yesterday we learned only today i have given you this grammatical information of its gender now we shall learn further contrast vowel contrast a o and o let me tell you in traditional Konkani Roman script, for all these three vowels, they use letter only O, this O. How to pronounce this? They have got three pronunciation, A, O and O. A, O, O. So I make them separate. Give an example here. Take this one now. Dar. T, Dar. To door, to door, and this one, te door, masculine plural door. See ropes. In traditional one, everything is written d o r. You don't know how to pronounce it, but here look at here carefully. Te door, to door, te door. Next one, sir. It is an intransitive verb, means grace. Chor, to chor, te chor. In traditional system, everything is written same spelling, same spelling. Therefore, confusion arises. Those who do not know Konkani, learners. They don't know how to say whether they, they should say sir or chor or chor. Here, different compartments. This you cannot say anything else. You cannot say this is sir. No, this is chor. You cannot read this as chor. No, this is chor. And you cannot read this anything else except sir. Then, ter it is a conjunction meaning so. This is. T tor belfry where the bell is tied in the churches up right there the construction that is called belfry tor T tor T tor raw mango different between tor 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 kur kur transitive verb 
Kor. Kor means kala. Tokor. Kala. And kor. Plural. Means colors. Kor. 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 Mer. Intransitive verb. Die. Mer. Tomur. Peacock. Te mor. Peacocks. Mer. Mur. Mor. Gird. To gird. Hill fort. On a hill if you have a fort that is called gird. Good. It is an adjective. Sweet. Thank God. Jaggery. See? Difference between gird, gourd and god. There are three different words, three different spellings and three different meanings. But in traditional way of writing, all same spelling, pronunciation is mixed up. Meaning one has to wonder what it means. Then, zer. It is a conjunction meaning if. Zor, to zor, fever. This is zor. Different types of fevers called zor. Next one, kare. It is a neuter gender. It is an adverb meaning true. There is no example here to give you. And this is kore. Te kore, the spade, which we use in the garden to dig. Kore. And this is kare. Kare, kore. Never. To pati, husband. And this is poti, ti poti, carry bag. And pote, neuter gender, sack. And here, our Catholics in Goa become a laughing stock. Instead of saying pati, mozo pati, my husband, they say mozo pati. And Hindus laugh. And due to this, the I have found a Catholics have got infinity complex. They uh, give up Konkani and they prefer to speak in English because they don't know the difference between these sounds pati and poti and pote. This a uh is practically lost in the Catholic Konkani in Goa. Not in everybody's uh, mouth. The vast majority lost it because of right, wrong writing system. Hindus don't have this difficulty. They read correctly. If they can read correctly, why others can't read correctly? It is possible. It is the hard work and determination. Let me repeat. To pati, ti poti, te pote. You cannot read this any way. Only one pronunciation for each of these words. All these words, one pronunciation. This one, third, the third bank of a river is third. This is third, transitive verb, break. And toned, te toned, face. To nut, actor. T note, currency note. T note, to nut. Tembol, to bold, egg yolk. It's called bold, to bold. Ani te bold. Egg yolks, plural of it. Bird, bold, ball. To cut, conspiracy. To coat, coat, English coat. Te caught, pot. Cut, coat, caught. Cup, to cup, sail. Te comp, hut. To compo, palette. 
tokolo bud tikoli the female fox and kolo fox male fox of course tothar layer thor is an adjective great and thorlo means elder masculine batato to batato potato tea boat english boat te bot finger batato boat bot garo garo a large fish hook to garo gori feminine adjective gori pun goro for a masculine we say goro for a feminine we say gori pair zord adjective heavy zord t zord earnings and jod pe te jod pe couple husband and wife her adjective each to hor marriage party in olden days marriage took place at home for from church they will come the marriage party that is called hor to hor and te hor marriage parties from the bride side and the bridegroom side then we say hor and this is one side then we say hor parto adverb turn porni is a feminine adjective old and porno is a masculine adjective old so in this you saw how these three sub three vowels these, these are three vowels with three symbols helps you to pronounce correctly and to know what is what meaning you have not suppose if it is written this way there is no other pronunciation except door and it it should mean rope only and if you write this way it has to be dar and meaning rate any doubts in this now father we have just 5 minutes left yeah yeah they can uh, carry on 5 10 50 i have no difficulty because this distinction is very important to learn anybody is having any questions can uh, unmute themselves and ask uh, hello sir uh, yes. i had a, a question about uh, consonants uh, um, can you please help me understand the difference between uh, like l um, la lan uh, yes and uh, you know a zodaksha like marathi zodaksha like from pustak is there any difference like because uh, in marathi this um, la or va is not consonant right they are zodaksha see jod jodakshar uh, lan uh, in the devanagari script there is no special symbol for that therefore okay. they say jodakshar okay. actually in konkani l lan is a consonant lh is a consonant but there is no one symbol for it so we write lh that's all okay yeah thank you Father, I had a question. Yes. Uh, you you spoke about the prefix of male, female, and neuter. Can you write yes. it down so that uh, we can? Uh, I I was confused by just the pronunciation. Is it possible for you to write it down? To What do you want me to write it? Write the 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 p and uh, yeah. It will come. Don't worry. Don't worry. Like the uh, prefix. Uh, what you call in pronoun, which I'm going to teach you tomorrow, it will come. To, ti, te. It's plural. Te, ti, o, ti. It will come. Don't worry. Don't worry. Tomorrow, okay. Okay. all your doubts are getting that cleared regarding to, ti, te. How to write it? Yes. Even in even in Marathi, we have a doubt of to, ti, te. Uh, uh, you know the Marathi equivalent. Marathi they say to, they don't say to. Konkani is to. Okay. Marathi they say to. to. to yes. Marathi yes. doesn't have open to. sound. Marathi doesn't have open yes. sound. 
Mm-hmm. Marathi doesn't have a f. F. They say five rupees. They they can't say five rupees. They don't say fox came. They say the fox came. They say, how are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. They say they can't say I'm fine. Yes. Most of the people, Marathi speakers, or for the matter for Indian language speakers, they cannot pronounce f. F. Mm-hmm. They say p h. Mm-hmm. Same way, this o sound is there in Konkani. It is, it is not in Marathi. Mm. That yes. does not mean Konkan is better than Marathi. No, 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 no. Each language has its uniqueness, unique yes. pronunciation. So Konkan has got to. The... Marathi has got to. To, huh? Father is ti to to the in Konkani or is it the pronoun for these words? They are pronouns which I said. Okay. I will. They will come tomorrow. I am going to teach you okay. all the pronouns. Once we finish all this vowel contrast, there are many vowel contrasts are there. No, okay. then you okay. will come. See, everything okay. cannot be learned at one time. I am no, teaching I'm just... certain things and certain things. It is not a linear absolutely. Yeah. For instance, see, I already taught you the gender. Here, I given you gender. Yeah, but actually, I have not taught you officially gender in Konkani. But uh, indirectly, I have taught you here, so that right now itself you will learn what is the dar gender uh, t rate uh, dar t dar manu zai Konkani. You cannot say to dar no or ten dar no. But so, then t and te becomes the uh, the rate. No, it, it's the word for the. Like in Portuguese, there's a gender attached to uh, the as well. When you say the girl and the boy, the yes. gender uh, changes. So is it that or is it he, she pronoun? No. Uh, what you gave the example uh, that uh, the the boy, it is an article there. For us, to, ti, te are pronouns, pronouns. Okay. If you just how how will remember the gender of this word by F M very difficult to remember. Therefore, I gave you a clue. You say T dar because this is F means T. Then the retention is faster. Okay. It is only an help. Okay. It's only an help, and you say to dar to dor to dor. Then it gets registered in a mind. Otherwise, just if you say door, 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 it may not that easily register as a masculine. Moment you say to door, to door, to door, then it registered as a masculine. It is only in a help. Uh, I don't think like there are any more questions. Okay. Can I can I ask one question? Only yeah. one question. I can answer a hundred questions. Uh, Father, okay. can you tell me the change in pronunciation of Thor raw mango and Thor great? Yeah, yeah. I will. Uh, uh, I write here and then I'll delete. Huh? Now, this is Thor. Oh. This is Thor mango. Okay. Okay. And you want that Thor, no? Thor. Thor is great, father. Not Thor. No, no, no. You want a great one. You wanted. Uh, because the spelling is T H O R for both. Can you no. just tell me the pronunciation, please? What What is the spelling is given there? You please tell me. I will type once again. T H uh, O R raw mango. No, T O R raw mango. T O R father. Ah. T O R. Thor. Fine, fine, fine. T O R. T O R is Thor, right? This T O R you cannot pronounce any other way. Okay, okay, okay. This has to be Thor. Okay. You can refer to the third row in the current screen. This has no other pronunciation. But T O R is so. And T O R is raw mango. Beg pardon. T O R. Yes. Is so. Uh, in the third line. 
T T O R. Huh? And what is the meaning you said? So S O. S O. This is ter. Yeah, like so See here. Ter. Okay. Ter. This is ter. Er. Ter. Because of the O. This is O. And this is O. Oh, therefore, I put in compartments differently. You can't mix up. These are different compartments. You, this this cannot enter uh, here, and this cannot enter here. Okay. Ah, this are like uh, a washroom. So, this are like a washroom. To give you an uh, example, no mix-up washrooms. Hmm. Ah, for ladies and okay, gents, separate. So we have so here three washrooms. One, hmm. two, three. No mixing up, father. Yes, yes. Ah. What is the word for raw? Raw, father. When we say raw, something is raw. That, that spelling is what, father? There is another one. Turno, turno. Spelling, father. Spelling, you know, spelling. Then you say, I will write here for you. Then I will delete. Okay. This one. Turno. Turno. Turno ambo for masculine turno, feminine turni, and neuter turne. That all we learn when we come to nouns. Father. Yes. Yes. What happened? How do you pronounce belfry, father? The Thor. second one. Thor. Tor and and Thor. mango raw mango is tor 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 okay. open tor and tor raw like how do you say got uh, bought tor. sought in English yeah. yeah that way this is like English goat goat <laughs> how do you say English goat G O A T that way tor, tor. closed this is open tor 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 goat tor Father, yes. Father, I was asking you if I want to type something in this Romi Konkani now. Yes. Where do I get this? Uh, uh, what style of uh, writing must I use to Portuguese style to get this circumflex and all? You get. I, I in the beginning of the class I said in, in the Android phone you download a Samsung keyboard. A Samsung keyboard. Okay. Keyboard. Okay. I think maybe you came late. I don't know. Yes, uh, but I keep late. Ah, see, well, therefore, let me repeat once again here. See, this is the Samsung keyboard here. Okay, this is the Samsung keyboard. Now I want to write this uh, uh, der. How to write der? I press D. I go to O. Press there, and you go here. See here. Der. Any you want to write a, uh, you go there. Now I want to write th this word, door, rope. How to type it? D. I press once again O. Go here. Door. And the last one is very simple that we know. D O R. Door. See, this is door, door, door. Now you want to type. Uh, any other word like chedu? How to type word chedu? Press here. Okay. You want this? You want to say maze? Maze means count. M. Press on this. Maze. You want to type this word more, this more. Type M, press on O, more. And the last one, going. You want to type going. Go on O, going. I think most of the phones have this keyboard, brother. If we uh, press and hold a letter, we usually uh, get those uh, letters with the symbols on top. Where? Yeah, correct. That's right. Sorry. Most on most of the phones, it is there, father. Yeah, uh, but I don't know what type of keyboard. Mine, mine is the G uh, G board uh, G keyboard. It doesn't have a 
uh, this uh, sir it cannot all others they have but sir is not there okay. Okay. only in the on samsung the, it is there other on the laptop how are you doing it in word ah laptop you know you go to symbols okay. i go to symbols and i create uh, the what you call those uh, macros so okay. you can just do it and show them once on the laptop itself they can see your screen here just type yeah. one word here yeah maybe uh, this one uh, that i can uh, show you you want me to show now uh, yeah you can further no okay problem. good i'll show you i will uh, download uh, this one first uh, mean i will minimize this i will take the uh, test file no sorry here my test file where it is gone now you can just open from the folder for that big pardon go to the folder and open it i have to go to folder no okay one minute i'll go to the folder and open my yes. test file uh, can you see it now yeah father you can see yes, yes father. father good now how to use those symbols now i want to type uh uh going car going okay g now i need o and over top of it i need that til how to go it go to insert take here symbols more symbols then you see here all the symbols are there you scroll it down slowly see here this one i say insert it came here going now what i have done for this symbol i have done a, every time i can't go to symbol i have done a shortcut key you go to here click on this shortcut key and here you can create a, a whatever you want to then you can create here how you say alt o means this one it will take whatever whichever key you can select it does that you do here and say assign then now for example let me do it here uh, i i i will say alt v for me assign finish i close it now i want to type going what i'll do g alt v see going Well, you have to remember because I created this alt V means O. Oh. Thank now you. That's, you want, that's very clear. Yeah. Ah, Thanks. you want to make now uh, maze. Maze means count M on E. You need a circumflex. <coughs> here there is a circumflex here. Say insert. I didn't come. One minute. It didn't come. Why? I, I I didn't select it here. Yeah. Now insert. It comes. I have made a shortcut for that. Oh, go here. See, I made a Alt E. I made a short this one. Therefore, when I press here M M Alt E, it comes. I have created that way. So you can create your own. Uh, macros they are called macros that's excellent thank you for similarly for or this a closed last one i'll give you or oh, i have created a macro for a uh, gori for me simple no need to go to simple go to short key and create your own symbol write it down and then you go on type Very I simple. Hope, I Very hope simple. It's uh, clear to everyone. Now yeah. on the laptop, they'll be able to type with. Uh, yes, on the laptop. But yeah. on the Android, absolutely no difficulty. You have Samsung keyboard. You select it. You can type all the words which I have given. You try today and see all mm -hmm. the words. So while um, having this uh, writing system, I had in before me this Android phone. 
so people should be it should be user friendly otherwise i create symbols and people don't get it what is the point so i i said this is important for me because people want to send messages through phone they can type this way any word you can try with these symbols okay uh, yeah. we'll uh, end the meeting for we are yeah. already 15 yes. minutes late no 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 not late for me i said for me that question hour can go on i have no difficulty about it because there are difficulties to be answered and i am here for that so now if you have to end we will end and uh, see you tomorrow dew bari rat dew that means good night okay. thank you so much can i close savio yeah for the weekend yeah okay thank you